All right, so the first niche is going to be uh, Space Astronaut Cat. Now, you're going to see this design right here if you look at it. This may be another AI design from the looks of it, but it's a pretty much, it's a, it's a, it's a cool type of design, but it was just, it was uploaded this year and it's making consistent sales right now. So if we come down and look at this BSR, nothing too crazy about this, but this is obviously a pretty cool design as far as, you know, the colors, you know, and then combining the cross niching two niches from, you know, cat and astronaut, right. Or, you know, space astronaut. But if you look at the BSR right here, you're going to see that it's started making sales and then obviously it turns into a consistent seller, right? And that's what you want as a print on demand seller. And then as you get closer, you know, into July, they seem like they lowered the price to help it give it more of a boost into the algorithm. Now, keep in mind with this right here, when you do this type of stuff, you're going to get more sales velocity in return. You're going to get more reviews. You're going to get more traction, right? And it's going to drive more traffic to the rest of your brand if you have more t-shirts underneath this brand. So, it's a it's a win win situation, and maybe this person is trying to get more sales going into Q4, right? We don't know, but this is more likely an ever this is an evergreen design. But going into Q4, I can see this one being like a top seller and giving you an idea that's a good thing, right? Going into Q4, having you know ten or twenty top sellers that are doing five hundred or a thousand dollars a month, that's a lot of money. So, space astronaut cat. Now, the next one is going to be from Fur Mama to Baby Mama EST 2023, established 2023. Now, from my understanding, I did a little trademark check right here. It seems like Baby Mama is trademarked those two keywords together. Now, there's something that you can do right here when it comes to this. So from Fur Mama to Mama to Mom to grandma to great grandma i can see that working too as well even if you want to you maybe mix in like dad from 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 fur mama to and you can you just a few things that you can mix up here so from fur dad to you know baby daddy right something like that right you, there's a few things that can be done here a few different ideas that will work really well inside this niche and nothing too crazy about this design it's not it's not uh, nothing that someone else can't do right and uh, just i think there's a few different ideas that can be done here if you look at the bsr too you can see that it's uh, selling over the years and turning into well it's obviously is a consistent seller by looking at it even if it sells you know you're seeing it sort sells like three or four or five, six times a month, right? I think if you put a little bit more ads to this and get this out there, you could probably run, you know, make 10 to 20 sales per month easily with this and then get it ranking, right? And there's just different ideas that you can be coming up with. With All right, so the next niche is going to be upside down pineapple. It's a swinger party. Now, it's this right here, if you don't understand this niche, I would literally do a search on it to get a better understanding of it. But this is a very, uh, there's a, there's a demand for this niche. And this is just like that simple logo design type of design upside down on that little, the little, where you put your name at. I can't even, the pocket, there you go. Pocket design. I was trying to think about it, but look, it's a simple, all white upside down pineapple. Like how hard is that? Right. But the point is, this is like, if you understand the niche, like you can create something like this and it can make sales for you. It's made its first sale this year, April 18th. But now it's like in June, it's starting to, I'm not sure if there's more swinger parties or not, but it's starting to make more sales and starting to rank into the algorithm, right? And that's important because once it starts to rank into the algorithm, when certain holidays come around or certain events that come around, this can be a top selling niche for you. So if you're not aware about this and you're unaware about it, what it means, I would do a little bit more research on it, but there's a very high demand on this for this niche on Amazon and pretty much any other platform, Etsy. If you do just do a Google search, right, you'll find it on there too as well. All right, next niche is going to be, I have no idea what this is. You got the floppy disk, you got this cassette tape, and then you got this VHS disk right here, or VHS tape. A lot of people like, right, that's out of this this is an old school thing, right? I think anything old school, retro, any of that stuff, it does really, really good. And you can tell, just looking at the colors, like who they're targeting, who they're going after, right? And it's, it's, a, it's a dope one. So if you can think of anything like this, like something that's, you know, old school, classic type of ordeal, and you can turn it into a design, you can literally create a top selling design for yourself. And it can be, you know, it's it's very cool that how it can be done. And now if we go down, Let's check out the all-time sales. 
you can see that it's made its first sale this year. And this is cool because it's like, and the next thing you know, look at it. It's just cranking, making sales. So if you think about anything like this, right, and, and this can, this is a top seller, right? It's doing like five to 10 sales a day. It, depending, it depends what it is, like depending on the holiday, right? Some t- probably doing 10, 15, maybe 20. And now you, if it goes like this consistently going into Q4, right, this one's going to be easily doing over like 15, 20 sales a day, which is really, really cool. But let's see like the first, the first day it was uploaded. It was uploaded in April, All right? So about three months and it's a consistent selling design on Amazon. And you can see that how it's taking up the whole design space too. You can see it's, it has a lot of color going on, but for the, it's taking up that whole template on Amazon merch to where it's a, you know, a top selling. I mean, it's a big, it's a big design on the actual, on that thumbnail and which in return probably gets a lot of more clicks than normal design. So if you're not doing that, make sure that you're doing that because this can, you know, help you get more clicks, generate more sales, help the customer actually see the design because if the customer is on their phone and they're scrolling up and down, right, and they can't see that thumbnail image from their phone, it's like they have to click on it, but they'll have to, the most likely they'll scroll past it, but if they can see it, they'll act, most likely they'll click on it to check it out. Like, this is a cool design. What sizes do they have, right? So keep that in mind when you're doing this type of research for your designs. Someone asked me in the last video, you know, how, what do I use exactly with Merch Informer? I'm over here in Merch Informer. I use the movers and shakers. I already have it up right now. And the cool thing I love, like I said, I love to use the movers and shakers inside Merch Informer. I want to have my affiliate link down below in the description. But one of the cool things that I enjoy personally using is this. Because look at Jamaica family trip, 2023, making memories together. This right here is a good design idea because now think about all the other vacation spots that you can do. All so many different niches that you can do inside of this family trip. Something like there's think about all everything like that. There's like probably like a hundred different designs that you can come up with just with this one idea. Now I'm here because you broke something, you know, a handyman t-shirt. You can see that, you know, what niche this is handyman. So we got two niches right here. We got family, vac- family trip, handyman. And then you go over here. We got back to school. We got Three different niches that we just found right now. If I keep going down, I there's so much more I can, you know, you can't tell me what to do. You're not my granddaughter. The granddaughter niche, right? There's there's so much that can be done here. Granddaughter, grandpa, grand, grand, granddaughter, grandpa niche. That's a, that's a whole nother one. You know, you have a farmer, third grade vibes. You got some back to school, right? You're seeing what's going on right now. What is selling? What's what's What are people going, going to buy? This was a cool one. Our elements. And it's spelled out tacos, right? Which is really cool, right? Chemistry, you can see what they're doing right here with everything science and who they're targeting. If you come down a little bit more, you're going to see that, look at, this is, a, you know, the pumpkin patch niche, right? Halloween's coming up. That's a big thing right now. And if we go down a little bit more, right? You got class of 2036. Let me go down. There's anime. And then I go down a little bit. It's my birthday. Fishing. Mom of the wild one. Yeah, there's, there's a ton of niches here, right? But one thing, too, is it's like you're seeing like that, right? You're getting ahead. Halloween's coming up. It's something you want to think about, right? There's something right there that you can obviously do research on and get ahead of everyone is as far as, like, you know, the competition and stuff like that. Because, you know, with Amazon Merch, it's like it's, it's good to get you. You get, a, you get ahead like 90 days. But at the same time, it's never too, too late to design for a niche that is obviously going to make sales next year because you, you have the idea now. You have the, you know the inspiration, you have that energy designed for it now, right? And then next year when it comes along, you know, hopefully you make sales. But for the most part, you want to get ahead and stay ahead of the competition. That way you can start to rank in those new designs. And if you can think of anything that's trending right now and create for a new design for, let's say, for example, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, you know, those are the next three big holidays that are coming up. If you can get ahead of those and, and, and do any type of cross niching, you can get ahead and start making sales. And if you want more research, check out this video right here. Thank you very much. Peace out.